Yo, yeah, what's good, YouTube? It's your nigga, Young Snoop, again. Young Snoop on oh, dick. That nigga that stay fresh with that cake right her neck. <laughs> yeah. What's up, man? You know what I'm saying? This nigga again. About to do another topic, you dig? I'm going to get it off for you, shorty. Yo, this is a big response to my nigga, Gray Bree all day. It's a G-R-A-Y-B-R-E. B R E A L L D A Y. So I guess to say your name right, Gray Bree all day. But chill, you know what I'm saying? You was that made a video response. I mean, a video request. Um, on um, you had did a video off of why? Well, like, what's up with you know? What's up? Get out of having sex with a film and not want to get pleasure back. Now that's a good thing. That's a good. That's a good topic right there. You know what I'm saying? Because really, you don't ever see a lot of shit like that, homie. So, big ups to you, you know what I'm saying? It's a big response to your V, homie. So, shit, that's how I look at it. Before I met my girl, before I met, like, other things I fucked with, when I was a little younger, I wasn't touch me now, still. Don't, you know, I might be getting the crown man and doing all this, but, hey, I wasn't I was touch me now, still. You know what I'm saying? Um, I didn't like no girl to come at me and touch me in the, this spot. Like, don't go below the navel. This is how it kind of was. Like, you could touch everything up here. And kind of my breast you couldn't touch because I was touching me not to the reason why I feel like I didn't want to I didn't want you to touch me there you know what I'm saying is because um I feel like they'll bring they'll like let me see they fucked up the stud in me I feel like that made me less of a stud made me feel like a little film you know like it kind of took my it just kind of fuck on my studhood you know what I'm saying so shit I feel like. It was fucking with my stud who homie, like, I, you, you know, it's just like saying that a stud getting ate out. You know, most of they never let it get done because they feel like they less than the stud. They feel like they're fucking film. They might as well call themselves a little film. And they acting like a little bitch, you know. But it ain't that, you know what I'm saying. If y'all both, if y'all both lesbians, then it's good to touch, you know what I'm saying. It's not like it's a nigga touching you if you're a lesbian and it's good for, for a female to touch you, you know. Um, so, you know, and... How how I used to get the pleasure out of I didn't want a girl touching me, but I used to touch her and I'm making you happy. I got pleasure because that girl was moaning. She was either saying my name, you know, she was either, you know, just the thought of it and even the the looks of it would just turn me on and get me hot and wet like ready for me to, you know, go hit me. Hey. You know what I'm talking about? So, you know what I'm saying? Gee, I, I was touching me, start not still my other, you know what I'm saying? But literally, really like studs that, that's kind of younger. And even with you older, they still got a problem with letting a girl touch them. Just like some stuff got a problem with the thing girl eat them out. And me, you know what I'm saying? I probably said this on my old channel. I ain't never want a girl to eat me out, homie. Never. Like, that was just the number one no no in the bedroom. Everything else was kind of like, okay, but everything else, like, who did that? That was like a, uh-uh, hold up now, don't do that, you know. But the girl I met, now, I'm going to be real with y'all, you two. You know, you know, even Flip on Dick was like, you know, she ain't never let no girl do it to her, whatever. And then she did it. She loved it. Of course, you know, every stuff goes through it. You know, I ain't trying to rush nobody. You should rush yourself. No, don't, don't even let your film rush you. When you ready, you will be ready. It's just society, especially if y'all in a relationship, then y'all both work on it together. You know, if you really want to do it. But look, try it out one time. If you don't like it, because if my girl, my, my baby say, far as in, in the bedroom, to try almost anything with this one time to see how it rides. And she don't like it, we ain't going to do it no more. And if I don't like it, we ain't going to do it no more. You know what I'm saying? It's like that with us. So just try it one time. Because I know me, I try it one time. I let my shouty. And, and, hey, it's good. You know what I'm saying? It's good. I ain't going to lie. It does feel great. It just, whoever you fool me with, I guess, if they know what they're doing. But my shouty, she knows what she's doing. You know, but the first time I let her do it to me, you know, I, I thought it wasn't even really that bad. When it happened to me, when it, when it started happening, I was just sitting there like, you know, one thing when you want to do it, you got to, your film or whatever, your stuff, whatever, they got to touch you, they got to, you know, make you feel relaxed. And then don't just hurt and go to it, you know, you got to relax your girl or whatever and make her just, you know, be all out. So once she good and she ain't thinking about nothing but just, oh, this feel good, 
Hey, you know what I'm saying? Go ahead and go slow. Do your thumb filter. Once it's over, she'll tell you she like it or not. Even if it's not over in the middle while you're doing it, she's like, I don't like it. Okay, well, baby, we ain't got to do it no more. You know what I'm saying? Because that's how it was with me, you know what I'm saying? When I love her do it to me, hey, I ain't been stopping the shit. You know, I was, you know, it wasn't even really that bad, though. It really wasn't. I thought it was going to be so bad. Like, it was just that, you know, like, my legs open. My girl eat me out. Like, what the fuck? I'm the stud. You ain't the dominant. You know what I'm saying? That's just why the stud thing, you know? That's what really makes studs and films different. So, that's how I got the pleasure, you know what I'm saying? So, I got pleasure out of girls just to, you know, you know, you know, moan and shit like that and touch me in some spots that I didn't mind to be touched in. That's how I got but, you know, I was like, I want to give you the pleasure. I don't want no pleasure back. Because I feel like if you put some pleasure on me, I feel less than the stuff things you'll be doing. So, I tried it out one time. And I like it, so we keep doing it. You know? So, it's nothing bad. Nothing to be ashamed of. Look, I'm not going to be ashamed of shit about because this is my motherfucking life and my motherfucking relationship. And, you know what I'm saying? Hey, everybody different. And you can't sit there and judge nobody because, hey, everybody tried something one time. Either is you know, something that I never would want to do when you do it. I wouldn't judge you for it. Yeah, I'm just saying I wouldn't do it myself, you know, but, you know, hey, you can't judge nobody, you know. But try things at least one time. Just let it do it to you one time. Just one time, bro. Just one time. And if you, you know, my, you know, if you fool with the right girl, you're going to be on it. You're going to like it. You're going to be addicted to it. But, yeah, you know what I'm saying. So, that's the first time. I, I, don't, I really, I don't know, but I'm just so, I am so how much I got. Oh, okay. I was just very so, um, I trust this girl like a lot, my baby. I really trust her. I ain't never trust no girl the way I trusted her. And I feel like I would never trust nobody the way I trust her. So, really, no girl ever ate me out. She's the first one to do it. She's the first one to do it. So, this girl I'm fucking with now, Destiny, she really got me, like, you know, you know, to get it for a girl. For a stud to sit there and say every girl that, you know, they never ate them out and they never let them was nasty shit. For they for that one girl to actually do it to them, that girl just, you know, they got you, you know. You can't lie. They got you. You know what I'm saying? Like, she's different, you know. And a lot of things that I do with her, I never would ever do. I never thought about doing with other females. So, it's just all in your relationship. Hey, I told you something, but I do keep it personal. I don't give all the details, but yes, you know. So, touch me not to, you know, don't rush yourself, but whatever happened, it happened. If it never happens, hey, but, you know what I'm saying, you know, just, if you want to do it, work on it. If you don't, fuck it. Don't, don't mess with it. But, hey, great, real day. Yeah, bro, this is topic, you know, video topic to, um, yo, yo, your thing or whatever. So, and all the other people, subs, films, tell me how you think about it. And fuck with my nigga, great, real day, you know what I'm saying. I post a comment on the beat. But yeah, go ahead and get to nigga girl. So put some comments at the bottom and tell me what you think. Too, I'm out.